Hey, it's Caroline. I want to take you through a few quick stretches you can do on a long road trip to get some movement back into your muscles, ease pain, and allow you to drive to your destination in health and style. So the first thing you're going to do when you get out of the car is extend your arms forward and take your feet a little wider than hips. circle your arms back. Good, do a few of those. So coming on down, squeeze the core, squeeze the glutes. Come on up and circle. So this actually allows you to engage your glutes and your abs, which often fall asleep after many hours of sitting on the road. Get some movement back into the muscles. Get your heart rate going a little bit. Bring some life back into your body after long days behind the wheel. And even if you're at a gas station, this is completely appropriate to do. Let's do one more. Doesn't take a lot to make a huge difference. Good, coming up. The next thing you're going to do is step one leg forward and one leg back. Come down into a nice deep lunge and pull your belly in and up. Squeeze your back butt cheek and reach your arms over your head. Palms face forward. Drop the shoulders and then pull the elbows down and reach the arms up. So here what you're getting is a hip flexor stretch from the back leg and a little small engagement of the upper back, opening the chest, breathing life back into the body. Good, let's do one more. Reach the arms up, take the same arm as leg on your thigh, lift up and tilt over, stretching through the hip flexors, really getting rid of all that damage that sitting behind the wheel has caused. Good, take a nice deep breath. Exhale, let it out. From here, stand up, grab hold of that back foot, and give yourself a little bit of a quad stretch. So often, long hours of sitting can tighten the hamstrings, excuse me, the hip flexors, the quads, and weaken the glutes, the core, and the hamstrings. So we're just trying to counterbalance all of that sitting with a little bit of movement. Let's do the other side. So other foot forward, other leg back, come down into that deep lunge, pull the lower belly in and up, and reach the arms towards the sky, palms face forward. Good, from here, opening the chest, engaging the upper back, and reach. Good, pull down, and It just takes a little bit of movement and a little bit of stretching, and it'll go a long way in helping your body feel fabulous when you get to your destination. Good, last one. Same arm as thigh in front, reach up and over. Woo, I feel this hip flexor stretch. Even after a short drive, this video feels fabulous. Good, stand up, grab hold of that back foot for a quad stretch. Pulling the belly up, finding a little bit of balance in the standing leg, and of course you can hang on to your car as you do this. Good, take a nice deep breath. Exhale, let it out. And release. The last stretch you can do is a car downward facing dog. So you're going to walk towards your car and place your hands on the car, walk your legs back, and let your upper body fall down. This feels really good to the shoulders and the chest. Take a nice deep breath. Exhale, let it out. And again, deep breath. Exhale, let it out. Walk back up. And relax. Those are quick, easy exercises you can do on a long drive or road trip to bring movement back into your body. Make sure that you don't feel dead from hours of sitting and just drive strong and healthy. For more health and fitness tips, check me out online at carolinejordanfitness.com. Thanks again and drive safe. I'll see you soon.